Hello, I'm Glenn. Today's tutorial is thanks to Will from Newcastle, who sent in this drawing of a tugboat. Let's have a look and see how he did it. For those of you who are using the splat for the first time, here's the three steps in drawing a cube. Slide up for step two, and then rotate the splat, line up the corners. Step three, boom. For the second cube, there's my new starting point. So I'm going to repeat the process, but I've got less lines to draw in. Just one there. And complete the cube at the back. Oh, that's looking really good. Let's do the same thing for a third cube. There's my new starting point. Two lines. Slide up. And rotate. So that's how easy it is to draw three cubes stacked in a row. We're going to add one more cube on top. So here's my new starting point right there. Step two, slide up. Already got one of the lines drawn there, so let's just draw that one in. Rotate. And now I have placed a cube on top. It looks like an upside down letter T. There's a few lines I'm going to remove there. Now replace your splat on that last cube again and trace in the oval or ellipse all the way around, slide on your pencil in that direction and then a short part of the oval and we have a porthole, cool. Now to uh, make it look like a ship at the front, so find halfway and join it with a big curvy line. Do the same thing on the other side of the cube. Nice. Now for the bottom of the boat, we're going to bring that one around. So do a little practice line first, and when you're happy with it, a nice smooth line and blend it in nice and evenly with the bottom. This line could be a bumper, could be a nice thick piece of rubber. So draw a second line under the first. Now I'm trying to make it look as if it's got some thickness. So I'm drawing another line at the back there as well and curving it around. Erase one line and then bring your line up and curve around. To darken in your drawing, first round off all the corners. And once I've done that, I'll come back and erase any lines I need to get rid of. And then draw a nice, neat, firmer line or darker line right around the outside. Great. I'm trying to make that look hollow at the back. It's time to draw a funnel in this area on top. Replace the splat back on the cube and in that top ellipse, trace it halfway around, just the half close to you. Slide up and now draw the whole ellipse. Connect the sides together. Erase the line that's hidden behind the funnel. It looks like I'll need to do a little fixing up here. For some decoration, I'm going to use the same ellipse and then slide down a little bit. And that could be a painted line around the funnel. I wonder what design you'll add to yours. Some type boats have old tyres all along the side so they can bump and push. I'm going to show you Will's drawing that he sent in. He's got lots of portholes and decoration. Great job, Will. I'd love to see some more drawings or ideas for tutorials. Email them in to me, guys. Thanks so much. Bye.